Hi, my name is Ruben Cabral, and this is my informative speech regarding life lessons for Communications 9. Now, I want to start off by saying I personally believe that there are a lot of life lessons that one may learn throughout the duration of your life, some of which can be learned through observing others' actions and learning from their do's and don'ts, some of which can be learned through talking to others and absorbing the information that they give us, and there's only some life lessons that can be learned through going through those situations and conflicts and learning the life lessons as the solutions to those conflicts, aka the hard way. Personally, I can say that a lot of the life lessons that I've learned, or lessons in general, have been learned the hard way. They made themselves apparent to me, the life lessons I mean, by being the key points and the solution to the conflict that I was facing. In today's presentation, I'm going to be sharing with you folks the three most important life lessons that I've learned to this day that stay relevant with me to this day. The first of which being that you should never judge something or someone based off what you see on the surface or the first impression that they give you. The second of which being you can never truly help somebody until you've helped yourself. The third of which being life and its perspective are related and life is what you make of it based on the perspective that you have. Now, with the first life lesson I'm going to be sharing with you guys, I was about 13 years old when both me and my dad took Taekwondo, one of the very few times we did something as father and son. Now, I witnessed my dad in a weekend bout get put up against a man who was both taller and physically bulkier than my father. I assumed that the match was going to be over extremely quick and that my dad was a goner. However, within the first four minutes of the match, my dad took me farther back than I've ever been taken back before and took the guy down, put him on one knee, put him in a headlock, made the guy tap out. Needless to say, I never assumed something about my dad very roughly ever again after that. But one of the life lessons, one of the first life lessons made itself apparent to me. You can never truly judge someone or something and assume the outcome of a situation until you've got all the facts. And sometimes you just gotta let the situation play out and see what happens. Having said that, I can move on to the second lesson. You can never truly help somebody until you've helped yourself. When I was in about my senior year of high school, I became acquainted with many people. And the reason I got along so well was because I tend to listen and absorb and relay information based on honest perspective. Now, some of these people were going through things that I could relate to, but there were also things that they were holding back. Personally, I, my issues started to build up as well. Internally, I was going through things in school, work, and at home that I can really honestly tell anybody about. However, at one point, it started to affect me and the friends around me, and people thought I started to ignore them. So I became more stressed out. So what I did was I pulled one of my closest friends to the side, sat her down, and I vented to her about everything going on in my life. And she helped me by helping me create solutions in which I could get past those issues and clear my own head and sense of, sense of self. After having done that, I went back, told my other friends about what I was going through. They understood, and we all got past it together. So... She helped me create my own solutions to my own issues. And overall, she helped me get past the problems that were plaguing me for the longest. All in all, the life lesson in that situation was I couldn't really help my friends until I figured out my own issues and help myself. And then I could truly go back as a friend and help them get what they were going through once I faced my own issues. Not having... Having described that situation, I can move on to the third most important lesson within my life. Probably the most important, which is life is based off your perspective of it. And only you can control your own perspective. Now, with said story, this friend helped me create solutions for myself by asking me about the things I liked and didn't like. The things I looked forward to and the things I wanted to look past. The creation, of the, the creation of the sense of self I had and what I was always facing and going through. 
She helped me realize that music is one of my number one coping mechanisms. And she helped me realize that I tend to downplay on myself a lot. So she started telling me about things that I could use to reinforce my sense of self and used to get past the problems I, uh, I faced on a daily. Life became what I made of it, which is the most important lesson in this situation. The perspective I carry and the perspective I create affects the life that I view and only I can control that. Now, having explained all of these, I do believe there are many more life lessons to be learned within my life with school just starting and me being this young, there are many more things I could learn. I'm happy I was able to share this all with you and I'm excited to see what you guys have in store. Thank you for listening.